ballistic missile defense, um, basically it, the problem that it brings is that the idea of nuclear deterrence is based on the bedrock of mutual vulnerability. Both sides are suggesting to each other that if you use a nuclear weapon against me, I will retaliate and both of us will be the losers in the game because there will be sort of, you know, huge damage that will happen as a result of the use of nuclear weapons. Now, when ballistic missile defense comes in, it upsets this equation on mutual vulnerability because one side is then trying to signal to the other that I might be able to use my nuclear weapons against you and cause you damage, but I can protect myself through the missile defense. So the when the Americans started with the concept of ballistic missile defense in 2001, after stepping out of the anti-ballistic missile treaty, uh, the Chinese were already beginning to worry about what it would mean for their uh, strategic uh, uh, deterrence because the fear was that their own deterrence would be undercut by the American ability to protect itself. Uh, now that's the same fear that comes between the China-India equation. If China has a ballistic missile defense, then India's ability to do unacceptable damage to China uh, gets neutralized or gets reduced to a great extent. Now when you have to counter that, what we've seen China do is to go towards MIRV missiles and expanded its nuclear arsenal. So the numbers have gone up from what it used to be for a long period of time stuck at 250. Now we are talking about going up to 350 and then the US uh, you know, Department of Defense report says that they could go up to even a thousand in the coming years. India might have to make similar calculations about increasing its arsenal. Though India's nuclear doctrine says credible minimum deterrence, but because um, of your recalculation of what would be what would be enough to cause unacceptable damage to China, some numbers might have to increase, uh, and therefore that's the impact that the Chinese BMD would then have on India's arsenal. One, increase in numbers and two, perhaps going in for MIRVED capability where one missile would be able to carry multiple warheads.